let's start lesson 3 northern mountain in india here you will learn about northern mountains lies in the region northeastern state let's read to learn in the previous chapter we have learned that the northern mountains are one of the physical divisions of india now let's read more about it northern mountains the northern mountains are the range of mountains in india they extend from kashmir in the west to arunachal pradesh in the east with a distance of about 2500 km with a width of about 250 to 400 km thus it covers an area of 6 lakh square km the himalayan range is the loftiest mountain range in the world it has an average height of 5600 meters these mountain ranges act as a barriers against cold winds to save our country from them this makes the life on plains easy and comfortable most of the peaks in the northern mountains are covered with snow throughout the year mount everest is the highest peak in the world mount everest note for the teacher discuss with the students about the northern mountains and its features also discuss with them how himalayas help india and its people tell them about the highest mountain peaks of the world k2 also known as mount godwin austen is the second highest peak of the world this mountain lies on the border of pakistan and china k2 is considered as one of the most difficult mountains to climb many adventurous brave men and women have climbed k2 the period between april and october is considered best to climb this mountain it takes at least 3 weeks to complete the trek quick fact The name K2 was given in 1852 by British surveyor T G Montgomery with K designating the Karakoram range and 2 since it was the second peak listed the northern mountains of India Bachindri Par Sir Edmund Hillary Tenzing Norgay There are some states that lie in the Himalayan area like Jammu and Kashmir Himachal Pradesh Uttarakhand Sikkim, Arunachal Pradesh, North of West Bengal, and some other northeastern states. The Himalayas are made of three mountain ranges, namely, first the Great Himalayas or Himadri, second the Middle Himalayas or Himachal, third the Lesser Himalayas or Shivalik, the Great Himalayas or Himadri. The Great Himalayas or Himadri lies at the top northern part of India. They remain covered with snow all the year round. The snow of these mountain ranges combines to form thick masses of ice and snow. These thick masses are known as glaciers. The lower glaciers melt to form rivers like Ganga, Yamuna, Indus and Brahmaputra. Annapurna and Kanchenjunga are the two high peaks of this region. Life of people is difficult in the Himadri region as it is very high. Very little flora and fauna is found in this region. the middle himalayas or himachal the middle himalayas or himachal lie just below the himadri towards the south these ranges are not high as the himadri they are covered with thick forest of oak pine and deodar trees orchards of apple and peach lie below these forests towards the east are the tea plantations some famous hill stations lie in this region like manali nainital shimla darjeeling Gangtok, Masuri, and Kullu. The lower Himalayas or Shivalik. The lower Himalayas lie below the Himachal ranges, in the southernmost part being the lowest part of the Himalayas. They are hill covered with thick forests. Many villages are in this region. The villagers grow crop like rice, potato, and other vegetables here to earn their living. Many wild animals are also found in this region. In the northeast. lie the purvanchal ranges these ranges are not very high and include hills like garo khasi mizo and lusai these hills are covered with very thick forest in the northwest lies the karakoram ranges mount godwin austin lies in these ranges past which is the second highest peak of india lies in the region the himalayan region consists of many states like Jammu and Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh, Uttarakhand, Sikkim, Northern West Bengal and the northeastern states. Let's read about them. 
Jammu and Kashmir. Jammu and Kashmir is a very beautiful state of India. It is also known as the heaven on earth. The climate in Jammu and Kashmir is very cold in winters and cool in summers. The valleys of this state are covered with thick forest of chenar tree. There are two beautiful lakes in this region known as Dal Lake and Bular Lake. Houseboats and shikaras can be seen in these lakes. Many tourists come to visit this state and see its beauty. Skiing in Gulmarg and Temple of Vishnu Devi and the Amarnath Caves are tourist attractions. Jammu and Kashmir has two different capitals. The summer capital is Srinagar while the winter capital is Jammu. People living in this region speak various languages like Kashmiri, Dogri, Urdu, Pahadi and Ladakhi. The people of this state wear firan and salwar. In cold months of winters, people use sangris, small pots of burning coal to keep themselves warm. They also drink kava, a special type of tea. During the summers, people grow crops like rice, maize, rajma, vegetables and fruit. During the winters, people stay at home and make handicrafts, carpets and clothes to earn their living. Houseboats in Dal Lake Skiing in Gulmarg Himachal Pradesh Himachal Pradesh is a state in northern India. It is spread over 21,495 square kilometers. Himachal Pradesh is bordered by Jammu and Kashmir on the north, Punjab on the west and southwest, Haryana and Uttarakhand on the southeast and by the Tibet Autonomous Region on the east. Himachal Pradesh is also a very beautiful state that has beautiful meadows, orchards and snow-capped mountains. Shimla is the capital of Himachal Pradesh. River rafting in Himachal Pradesh In Himachal Pradesh, people speak mixed languages such as Hindi, Punjabi, Kinnori and Pahadi. The people living in this state are mostly farmers. They grow crops like rice, maize, barley, fruits and vegetables. Some people also rear sheep and goats. People of the state wear colorful woolen coats and firan along with pajamas and churidar. People of Himachal Pradesh Uttarakhand Uttarakhand state is divided into two divisions namely Gadwal and Kumau. It is the only state in India with Sanskrit as one of its official language. This is the state where two most important rivers originate, that is, the Ganga at Gangotri and the Yamuna at Yamunotri. The climate in Uttarakhand is cool in summers and very cold in winters. The lower region of the state is dry and hot in summers and cold in winters. This region is covered with oak trees. Dehradun is the capital of Uttarakhand. Men of Uttarakhand wear woolen coats and pajamas in winters and shirts and trousers in summers. Women wear saris. Sikkim and West Bengal. Sikkim is located in Himalayan mountains. It is a very small hilly state. Sikkim is the only state with Nepali majority. Its economy is largely depends on agriculture and also tourism. Sikkim is cool in summers and very cold in winters. During the monsoons, the state experiences major rainfall. High mountain ranges like Kanchanjunga lie in this region. The thick valley is thickly covered with forests. People mostly depend on agriculture and grow oranges, apples, tea, rice and orchids. Gangtok is the capital of Sikkim. People of Sikkim. Tea plantation in Darjeeling. Quick answer. What is the capital of Sikkim? What is the capital of Uttarakhand? Northeastern state Northeast India comprises of seven states commonly known as the Seven Sisters. These states are Assam, Arunachal Pradesh, Manipur, Meghalaya, Mizoram, Nagaland and Tripura. Each state is a traveler's paradise with picturesque hills and green meadows which shelters thousands of species of flora and fauna. These states cover an area of 2,55,511 square kilometers. It has over 2,000 kilometers of border with Bhutan, China, Myanmar and Bangladesh. 
and is connected to the rest of India by a narrow 20 km wide corridor of land. These states had a population of 44.98 million in 2011, about 3.7% of India's total. Arunachal Pradesh is the largest northeastern state. People living in this state built tilt houses because of heavy rainfall in this region. The festivals and celebrations in the northeastern states of India are a colorful reflection of the people and their life. Arunachal Pradesh Tilt Houses Manipuri Dance Maksenaram Heavy Rainfall Area People of Mizoram People of Nagaland Quick Fact The Seven Sister States is also known as the Paradise Unexplored.